Hey guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Alright, this is going to be week two. Who's it for? The lovers. Gemini. So you might have a decision to make. You might be meeting somebody. It'd be a very... Um, It would be a connection, be like a bonded connection. <clears throat> okay. You're dealing with your past. This is somebody who is not happy with the situation, wanting to go back to their past. Somebody who maybe didn't tell you about how they were feeling. Um not wanting to be over, feeling betrayed, stabbed in the back, arguments, competition. There could be, you could be dealing with a child here, or you could be dealing with somebody who's extremely immature. Could be a family situation. Again, it could be a child. It could be a teenager. Something going on there. But this has to do. Okay, so there's a there was interference clearly. Okay, um, not for all of you. Some of you that you could just be like, oh my gosh, I thought this was gonna be the one. I thought we were gonna have a family. We we're gonna have kids. We we're gonna settle down. Yada yada yada. Um, but this is somebody who is really upset about a situation, not telling you how they feel, emotional. There's immaturity here. Majority of you, there was some type of interference. There was already a family dynamic. There was already a marriage. There was already something there. And it's just, it's, it's not good. It's not, not working. Others of you, this could be a secret reveal. This is somebody not listening to their intuition. This is... Somebody where they could have found their happiness, contentment. They chose not to open up. They chose not to talk. Page of Cups is reversed. Okay, So this is somebody who didn't follow their intuition. This is somebody who doesn't want to be vulnerable. This is somebody who wants you back or vice versa. Yeah, they want to work on things, work together, or they're just focused on work. The song that just came to me is, um, come back to me. Uh, uh, I think it's a big pun, but, um, more focused on work. Again, two eights. Yeah, see, somebody didn't put the effort into this and feels defeated now. Somebody put zero effort into a situation. There's arguments, there's competitive energy, this this is this is energy of <sighs> not putting work in, not fit, not not feeling secure. Empress reverse is someone who doesn't really take care of the home, doesn't take care of the children, doesn't nurture, doesn't give. Okay. Um it's not accepting. Someone doesn't like what they heard. Someone doesn't like what's happening. No love in this situation. Complete toxicity. This is not an obsession. Okay, this is a very unhealthy situation. There's no love here. There is there is something here, though, with the lovers. There's, there's some regret here of how something went down because they want it back. Yeah, so there was, there's a blockage that's about to be removed so you can move forward. The feminine this week are coming in strong under Taurus energy. Secrets being revealed, not following their intuition. I feel like the high priestess in some situations can be somebody, but it's, it's more secrets, lies, exposed. Finding out that some of you could be finding out there was no pregnancy. Someone lied to you over a pregnancy. That's for damn sure. That's not good. Could be a loss of a child. 
because you have a feminine that didn't take care of themselves and was more worried about what was going on behind the scenes around them than they were taking care of themselves, their body. So I'm sorry if that was a situation for some of you. If you happen to miscarry and this isn't your story, then, you know, um, incredibly sorry for the, the loss. This looks like more immaturity. There's no love in a past scenario, in a family scenario, something that, you know, went went on for too long, wanting more. It's unhealthy, unhealthy attachment. This could be somebody that attempted to go back to their past. There's no love, it was just sex. Yeah, no, this is somebody who wants to figure out how to keep it going. So now you have the emperor that's pissed off too. Okay. You have a married couple, a core couple. You have two two energies here of the emperor and the emperor reverse, not putting energy into something. It's just, it's not working out. Somebody else interfered. There's somebody that's more suitable. Somebody that knows how to nurture, knows how to care, knows, has to, know, knows how to work, knows how to do all sorts of things. I don't know if it's too late. It looks like there's a blockage being removed, but it might be too late. All I know is that you got the fool at the bottom of the deck. It's like having a new start, new energy, taking what you need and just going. A new journey, a new path. So let's see my little Gemini's. You definitely have a better suitor. Wow, look at all that major arcana. Got the devil, the hangman, and the strength. Got the devil reverse, getting yourself out of an unhealthy situation, looking at things differently, having the strength to move forward. Looks like if there was too many people in the picture, you're taking yourself out of the equation. There's no question. I'm dealing with somebody who's got a lack of confidence, wants you back but is giving to other energy too. There's still secrets. There's still things that need to be exposed. Okay. It is, to me, it is time to heal. It's from what I'm seeing, it's time to heal. It's time to move on. Um, you, you do have energy if you were dealing with somebody who was, you know, extremely immature about how they went about something or is still continuously going about something. You want more, go get more. Don't waste your time in, in this energy. Somebody wants to move forward. They want to see things differently. They want to talk to you. They want to nurture. They want a reconciliation. They want this, but they you're dealing with somebody who still does not know how to give. Probably because they're still giving to a different situation. So be wary this week about who and what you're entertaining. Gemini. Staying alive, staying alive. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, don't, don't, don't go back to the past. I, I hate to say that. I mean, you can obviously do what you want to do, right? And what you feel is best for you. But, you know, <laughs> there's too many people in this equation. You do have the King of Cups. That's still in your energy. And it's stressed out. So I don't know. To me, it, it's just like you're not dealing, you're, you're unrestricted. You're not dealing with this. And now it's like shit. So you do have a mask on here that wants to, you know, drop the weight trying to figure out how to do it but it's, you're dealing with somebody who's not not solid this week um stressed out they're not grounded
yeah, see, the, the, there's a masculine energy that's not happy. I don't know if you're wrapping something up, but they're, they're, they're not happy with you, their own past. It, it's not winning, not being victorious, but wanting the past back. There was definitely some type of interference here. It's pulling me to this deck that I did not even want to use. All right, my little Gemini's real quick. Week two. Engagement, ring, partnership, commitment, eternity, completion, union, mirror, mirroring each other, self wounds, introspection. So you, there is an energy that really does want to, you know, be with you. It was probably the, the lover card because that's always a special connection and a love call. Someone expresses their love thinking about you, letting you know. So you do want something as somebody else, but it's just there's so much turmoil. There's, there's so much going on in somebody else's life. Um, unfortunately, they're not giving you the focus you need, so hopefully that will, will kick in. Yeah, see, it's, it's like still having a little bit of a blockage. It's, there's still a blockage. Unless they're going to come in and fight for you. Looks like they are letting the past go. They're no longer letting certain things get the best of them. Again, you are dealing with the emperor. So it does look like, you know, somebody does want to get to know you more, want to be with you, let, let them, let you know how they feel. But... They, they have to push through their own blockages. It does look like there's a blockage about to be removed here, though. Or you've just had enough and you're fed up and you let it go. No, see, the tower of reverse. See, this is somebody who didn't want to accept that maybe you're letting them go. See, yeah, it's a masculine that didn't want to accept. And again, it's I'm holding it the other way now. It's, it's the same thing, not accepting something, you know. Um, so... I wish you luck. Please do what's what's best for you because it, it does look like there's there's something here. But there's it's I mean it, it for some of you they can come in and, and, and put up a fight, um, and fight for you and, and stand in their morals and they don't want to deal with the past anymore. And they wanna let you know. They want to move forward. Yeah, there's somebody that definitely wants to give give to you is trying to have the strength to come in and, you know, and that song down on bended knees. What is that? Boys to men. That song just came to me. So this could be long term. It could be somebody you're dealing with that you will end up marrying and being with. I don't know what that song's about. Bended knee down on a bended knee. I mean, that's usually a proposal. I don't see a proposal. Any anytime soon, here, yeah. <laughs> right? It could be something. Um, they're they're dealing with the past, hashing it out. But this is the past that that wants you back, and they 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 don't they they're gonna fight. They're gonna fight um, for you. This is somebody who wants to win, always win. You're dealing with an emperor energy, someone who always wants the control. See, you're dealing with somebody who does not like vulnerability either. This is a very detached energy, a masculine energy. Focuses elsewhere, more practical scenarios. Okay, so again, you know, we all make our own choices. I hope you guys make the right choice. I love you guys, and I'll see you on Patreon.